Hi everybody. Well, it's definitely getting to be fall where I live and the leaves are turning and it's looks it's windy and looks like it's going to rain here shortly outside. So it's a perfect time to grab a cup of tea. And I thought I'd do a video today about what I'm currently reading. Here's the spot. And what I'm currently reading is My Cousin Rachel by Daphne du Maurier. I'm pretty sure I picked this up at my local library book sale. And um, so far, I'm, I'm enjoying it. I've read uh, Daphne du Maurier's most famous um, work, uh, Rebecca. I've also read Frenchman's Creek and Jamaica Inn. And My Cousin Rachel is a story of a young man who was orphaned at a young age. He was like a baby when he was orphaned, and he's taken in by a bachelor cousin named Ambrose. He never Ambrose never married or had kids, and, and so Philip kind of fills that spot for him. And he Philip is kind of groomed to because Ambrose is a rich man, groomed to take over things eventually. And as Ambrose gets a little bit older, he has health problems. Um, and his doctor suggests that he needs to go to um, warmer climes to to help him. And he goes to Italy, and he meets this woman named Rachel, and shortly afterwards, Ambrose dies. And Philip is very um, upset, and he wants to know what happened. And uh, so, anyway, that's kind of where I'm at with this. And um, he's meeting um, Ambrose's wife, where I'm currently reading right, where I'm at currently reading right now. So it's 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 really good. I'm also um, reading this with my mom, <laughs> and she has, um, and we both never read this, and she has an autobiography of Daphne du Maurier that I eventually want to get my hands on. I really want to get my hands on it, <laughs> so I can read it. So anyway, so this is really, really good. And I'll um, let you know my final thoughts on it. I'm also, I'm still currently uh, reading Charles Dickens' American's Notes. Um, I've, I've read a couple of other books that I haven't shared with you. I'm going to do a September and August wrap up and I'll share those books with you. But I still, I've kind of set this book aside and I really want to finish reading it. And it's Charles Dickens' American Notes. And I know, I, I know I've told you a little bit about this before. Um, Charles Dickens, um, in the 1840s, made a trip to, um, to America. Um, and this is the story of his travels, which I really want to, yeah, I really need to finish and reading. And recently I went out of town and on the way home we stopped for gas and there's just like this little strip mall to the side of the gas station and there's an antique store and at the very end there is um, a bookstore that I had never been to, uh, a used bookstore. So of course we had to go. <laughs> there was no, yeah, yeah, we, yeah. We had to go. <laughs> and of course, I had to pick up a couple of books while I was there. So, and I picked up The Virgin, The Virgin's Lover by Gregory. So this looks really, really good. In the autumn of 1558, church bells rang across in England. And rang out in joyous news that Elizabeth I is the new queen. One woman hears, hears the tidings with utter dread. She is Amy Dudley, wife of Sir Robert, and she knows that Elizabeth's ambitions, ambitions leap to the throne will draw her hus husband back to the center of the glamorous Tudor court where he was born. Um, for those of you who don't know, Queen Elizabeth I, like way, way back, um, and Robert Dudley were supposedly lovers, and, um, and and Amy, his wife, was was killed. So, and he was always kind of suspected of having it done. <laughs> so, and there was a big there was a big old scandal about that. So, this is about that. 
So it just looked really, really good and interesting. And also, I picked this up, which looked really good. It's called Washington's Lady, a novel by Nancy Mosier. And this is a story of Martha Washington, George Washington's wife. Though still a young woman, Martha Custis is a widow, but she is not without means and has no desire to remarry. Not, that is, until a striking war hero steps into her life and she realizes that she's ready to love again. So this is, this really sounded really, really good. So I'm hoping to get to these soon. And I think that is it for now. Thank you so much for watching. Um, I should have another video up. Um, I'm going to do a September and August um, wrap up video. I didn't do one for August, so so I'll do that. And then um, a, an October TBR so <laughs> video. So anyway, thank you so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed this video. If you read any of these books, please um, comment. Um, like and subscribe if you are so inclined. See you later.